A small plane that crashed shortly after taking off from Gillespie Field has yet to be removed from the scene. That plane went down just before 7 at Cuyamaca Street and Prospect Avenue in Santee, killing two people. Two dogs were rescued, but one of them later died. Our tennis reporter Vanessa Van Hefti is joining us with new information on the moments that led up to that deadly crash. Vanessa. Yeah, Steve, we're about a mile east from Gillespie Field, so very close, and you can see the plane here right behind me, the, the tail sticking out of the fence there. The pilot had some mechanical issues right after takeoff, and one witness caught the horrifying first moments all on cell phone. A witness recorded the moments the plane started to fall from the sky. He's crashing. He's going down. He's going down. He is in trouble. People heard a throttling noise and then looked to the sky in terror. The pilot making a circle, trying desperately to make it back to Gillespie Field just before 7 a.m. We just saw a plane go down about one mile, uh, three quarters of a mile northwest of our airport. This brother and sister on their way to West Hills High School shaken to their core. It looked like it was going to come hit our car. The teens parked and ran. By the time it, it hit the ground, I was already over here running to it. That was hard because you never know what you're going to walk into. Yeah, see if we got major damage to the front of the plane. We have the active fuel leak right now from a wing tank. The pilot and lone passenger died instantly when the Cessna 182 Skylane crashed nose first into this glass company's lot next to the airport. We got a lot going on. We got a fuel spill, several patients trapped, possibly 1144. And everybody was screaming, is anybody in there? Does anybody need help? And there was just no response. Then, out of the mangled wreckage, a sign of life. We do have a dog visible that is alive if you want to start animal control. Really surprising just to know that that can happen in a matter of seconds. Two dogs rescued from this plane. One is being treated right now, but as we mentioned, one did not survive. This plane we know registered to John and Cheryl Longhurst out of Darby, Montana. The NTSB tonight still investigating, still trying to determine what went wrong. Reporting live in Santee, Vanessa Van Hefti, 10 News. Thank you, Vanessa. And there have been several plane crashes near Gillespie Field in recent years. A pilot and two passengers were injured in December when a single engine plane crashed into a parking lot off Gillespie Way near Weld Boulevard. In September, a small plane lost power after taking off and crash landed on North 2nd Street near El Rey Avenue. And in September of 2015, a flight instructor and student pilot were killed when their plane crashed into a roof of a Santee house. All right, we have